Despite the political turmoil in Alberta politics, it appears the votes might be locked in. New polls suggest there's barely been any movement in support of either party during this election campaign. And while it looks like voters haven't changed their minds, one political scientist says that could all shift after Thursday's debate. Less than two weeks until the provincial election, and all polls are pointing to the United Conservatives on taking victory, despite the UCP's drowning in controversies. Mr. Smith has apologized for those remarks. He issued a statement today. Taking a closer look at the latest numbers by the Janet Brown Opinion poll released Wednesday show the UCPs have the support of 53% of voters across the province, compared with only 34% for the NDP. According to Research Co., 45% of voters would cast a ballot for the United Conservatives. The New Democrats come in second with 40%. I'm going to let voters decide who's going to win this election, uh, not pollsters. But more interestingly, the poll reveals a whopping 27% of voters remain undecided. This political scientist believes that group could help shift the numbers after the debate. Usually, if there's a, a, a big knockout <laughs> moment in the debate, it could shift the numbers, right? But the polls can be inaccurate. Remember the last provincial election? All polls hinted at a PC victory. Polls are a snapshot in time, so they should be taken in that context. There are lessons to be learned from the polls, says Mense. For instance, Research Co. shows that three in ten Albertans say their opinion of Nolly has worsened since the start of the campaign. And 38% say the same thing about Kenny. Make sure to tune in Thursday night to City TV, where the four leaders of the major parties will face off in their first televised debate. In Edmonton, Rochelle Sufi, City News.